Depressing. It is that time. Tape's rolling. Right on the set. Get ready to go live in the radio. Zoom Room Video Communications brought to you by the BMC. Quiet on the set! You're listening to WRFB, a Radio Free Britannia, and this is Lunch! Coming to you live from Deltona, Florida, here are the dynamic duo themselves, Laz and Jack. Greetings, everybody. This is Laz. And this is Jack. Welcome to another edition of Lunch. With and whatever Laz. you did, you stuck what? us. You connected what? and left it connected, you um, fool. Connect, it. do it, and disconnect. Now you screwed everybody up, i tell you what. How so? How, so? <laughs> how, how did I screw everybody up? I got my stuff pinned. You didn't uh -huh. get your stuff pinned? It's pinned, but you connected the other one, and it hung everything up. <laughs> it only hung up you. It didn't hung uh, up, well, hang up me. I, I told you we can't have the three connections not working you don't listen I, 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 I should be disconnected well you're not disconnected be not if, welcome, if I could welcome, figure welcome. out how to disconnect <laughs> I think I might have just disconnected both of us I don't know what did you, I just do you, no you I think you just disconnected yourself yes the, the weird thing is I, I don't even have the camera turned on and yeah that, I don't I, know what's causing uh, causing that for uh, but once yeah, you welcome, pin, welcome get back. the hell out of there. <laughs> it, well, I don't know how to disconnect on my phone. Uh, disconnect? Um, there is no disconnect button. Yeah, there is. It's called leave meeting. Go back to your meeting. Yeah, yeah, I had to go all... So it went from this screen, then you actually have to swipe to yeah, over to, exactly, to, get to, yeah. to get get to the leave meeting. Problem? Not my fault. It's stupid. I'm not the one that designed this shit. And of course, yeah. Now that left us with no you again. So I got to do. What I've I'm got me. Say. I've got me. <laughs> Everybody can look at my beautiful frozen f face because you didn't pin me to the right one. I had you pin. You were the one who screwed things up. Oh, you know. can pin with two you, people. You're, you're I had you pin. See, connect, pin, disconnect. Thank you're you. good. See, there Thank it goes. You. What am I? <laughs> Welcome I'm, to I'm today's good. show, boys and girls. That's right, Vosh. The best shit show on the air, brother. You won't find anything better running here. And of course, uh, yes, we never know what the hell's going on because there is no script. Welcome no script to Thirsty whatsoever. Thursday. It is July 18th, 2019. I don't even have a giveaway set up yet today, boys and girls. So let's go ahead and do that real quick is uh find ourselves a giveaway what do we want today let's see i'll put the Porn. list up there Porn. and i'll i'll let people uh shout out what we got i know one of them's gonna be a palomino so what do you think the other one should be porn uh, yeah yeah um, yeah a pony a pony a pony um, you're gonna do porn yeah. with a pony you're gonna do the pony show what yeah that's a donkey show never mind yeah. Anyway, anyway, something. I know. So, 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 did you enjoy the three memes that I just posted? To I uh, haven't had a chance to look at anything. I've been trying to get everything up uh, and running here, yeah, and uh, you, you haven't looked at Discord lately. Last, then. last, uh, yeah, last minute yeah. catch up here. I got to get a giveaway here. So let's start with the Palomino. 
A Palomino horse. Just so y'all know what it is. Yeah. Exclamation! I love free shit. You know how to get in. Let's make those daily announcements out in the chats and let everybody know we're here. I know. That sort of busts it for all you early birds, but you know. We gotta let everybody know. It's one of them things where we actually have a little bit of news game. today. We have some updates. We game, have caffeine. I kind of actually want to watch that competition. <laughs> I, I don't know why. I kind of want to watch it. What competition? I guess I should look over and zoom and see. Uh, <laughs> why, why zoom? In Discord. That's, yeah, whatever. You know what I meant. Uh, to change your name inside of Discord for just this channel, you uh, right-click on your name and go to change nickname on the right side. If you can find your name that way. Uh Oh, wait, I, yeah, 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 something like that. And that's Enos. Yeah, maybe. I, I, I don't know what this news is that you, you want to share with people. Let's see, is anybody giving me uh, anything yet? No, Guess they have not. not. Everybody's but... just getting in on the raffle. Okay. We'll figure something else out here in a little while then. We'll we'll figure it out on the fly. Maybe we'll just give away two Palominos. We've got a whole bunch of them in here. So we'll, we'll figure that out. But meanwhile, that's the first giveaway yeah, yeah. for today. Hex would like you to give him some scrap. Some scrap? You want some wood scrap? Yeah. Sorry, yeah, can't do that. It, yeah, Hex would like some scrap instead of patterns. Ah, well, yes. Uh, that's... Uh, out of our control, of course. Again, uh, lots of talk about stuff like that. Uh, lots of talk about upcoming changes. Lots of talk about... Did somebody say specialization? What? Uh, I, I someone, don't know. So, someone <laughs> said smoke test as well. Yeah, well, uh, let's let's <laughs> get let's get right to the smoke test. Uh, pop, pop. Okay, I, I yeah, really need to grab, scroll grab up for your that vapes one. first uh, because we got to get a little puff yeah. in. And uh. yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, hold hold on, hold on, hold on. That was the server stuff one, right? Yeah, it was. Correct. That's the server okay. stuff, and of yeah. course, uh, yes, we have some updates coming from Chris. And his live stream, and uh, since I guess he's been busy with server stuff and all sorts of other stuff, uh, we're yeah. just gonna go cut right to the clips. We'll let you guys hear what he's got to say. And uh, now, this one is actually like 20 minutes long. I don't know when you actually want to stop it. Though. I don't know if it's... Uh, it, he's got a lot to say here, so we're going to go, and uh, I will cut us when the yeah, time is uh, time is right, because uh, okay, we got a couple so, things to get to, and again, uh, you know, all, all we really got to do is just get to the fun stuff. We really don't I, have to cover every yeah, little bit, no, but we, we, we may, we, dep no. depending on... Uh, you know, how the flow goes. So let's yeah. count that in. And uh, okay, so let's go ahead and click play on that ten minutes and three seconds. In three, two, one, play. Uh, let me go to the server stuff now that we're up, uh, getting close to a hundred people. <laughs> uh, no, Griffler, do not come drink my scotch. I think I can get plenty of offers and for the local people for drinking my scotch. Uh, let's see. Uh, oh, server stuff. Now that we're up to close to 100 people, let me talk about server stuff. So, this all started like last week sometime. A big storm came through, which had absolutely nothing to do with our servers, but did have to do with how long, it did impact how long it took to get things back up. Uh, didn't have anything to do with our servers. We never, the server. Uh, data center never lost power they i mean maybe there's some minute fluctuations but this machine was the same one that dropped a few weeks ago uh that the power went out and i had to go up in the morning and reset it uh and we replaced that box so yay a whole new box except the problem is because we lost four boxes at one i didn't have the proper type box ready to go and smoke tested 
Uh, it was kind of ready to go, so I took it down there and threw it in. Uh, and sure enough, we didn't have a chance to smoke test it. Hey, guess what? Bad memory on it. Uh, so servers use uh, ECC memory, which is error checking and correcting. Uh, which, just so you know, that's what the I think the ECC stands for, uh, ECC RAM. Uh, but that is absolute bullcrap. Uh, it does not really check and correct. What it does do is it can give you warnings if your memory is starting to die rather than just corrupting things. Uh, so that's what actually happened was we have some ECC memory on that node we had it on that was dying. So the first time it died, that's when Undone went up and earned his stake by going in the middle of the night to reset the box. And he didn't do anything other than just like, turn it off, turn it back on. Uh, so of course we were like, well, Guess that's going to be uh, coming back up as a problem again here any day now. So I actually went in the very next morning, four hours later or whatever, and uh, had built out four flash drives so I could go and run mem test on them. So I ran mem tests on the other three nodes as a smoke in for those guys. And one day later, the next morning, is when the server died again. I think that was Saturday morning. Was that Saturday morning or Sunday morning? It all bl or blurs together. Uh, but that was that second, actually third outage that we had that, uh, after not having outages for years, we had three outages. It was a one server dying, replacing it with for another server, and then having that one have ECC memory failures. Uh, but now we have it on one that has been through a smoke test, and it should be good. Uh, so uh, knock on wood or whatever's around you. Uh, hopefully that's going to be stable for a while. And I'm in the process of going through all of our hardware and pre-smoke testing it, so we don't have that uh, we don't have that type thing happen again. One second. <whistles> dun -dun 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 -dun. Waiting on the dog. There you go. Good dog. <whistles> Annoying, but good dog. Uh, but anyway, so if it happens again, we've got another backup and actually, cause I want to get all this crap out of my house. Now I'm getting these boxes out of my house. Uh, it's actually feeling like I might be able to recover my house soon and be back to a normal life. Uh, so I'm trying to get those all smoke tested, set up, and I'm going to take them and install them in the data center, even if they just sit there unplugged. So the current machine it's on. Uh, now that we have, we're making all of our plans, assuming, because we did lose, for those who don't know the nodes that we put these things on, they're on nodes, which is basically it's a server box uh, to you rack, and it's got four nodes in it, and each node is a full dual processor Xeon server. Uh, but this is the first time we'd actually seen four of them die, because there's not many moving parts that are in the whole machine, you know, beyond the power supplies, which it has uh, double redundant power supplies. So anyway, so now we're planning, making all of our plans. We had been making our plans on like one or two boxes going out. Now we're making all of our plans on four boxes going out at once. Uh, so that's going to be what's keeping me busy for a while. And what's making me lose sleep for a while. Is my eye twitching? Uh, <laughs> let's just say less sleep than normal uh, for a while here as I get all these things done. But also this is impact, going to impact me a little bit. Uh, grumpy, grumpy, hold on one second. I'm going to go do something. I'll get this going here. Uh, rather than just looking at a wall, I'm going to get the printer set up on this computer. I've got it set up in there, but I'm going to move it in here so I can actually, uh, print stuff on the fly. Cause that's actually going to be something I do over the next few weeks is when I'm on stream. If you have something and you're one of the people like who didn't get a box or you want to buy a box, I'll probably put some boxes up for sale or some trinkets up for sale and just ship them right then on the stream. Uh, so let me get that set up in just a minute. And I will ship that to you right now. Is that where you're a grumpy crab never? Rather than a happy crab never? Uh, but let's see what other stuff. Uh, we do also, right now we're not planning on buying new servers because it looks like we're going to have at least two full nodes of backups, which is eight boxes. Uh, we still are being cheap bastards on some licensing stuff, which is why we're not running two game servers. We actually are running two game servers. We have two licenses for the one piece of software we have to license. 
uh, but one of them is on the QA server, one's on live. Uh, so that's why we don't currently have them set up to fall over automatically if one fails. Because uh, right now there's one on each of those two. So uh, we also, the other things we, oh, they where the storm comes in, I forgot to mention that part. So the storm didn't cause the outage. That was a miscommunication between Keith, uh, Sanyo, and Star that Sanyo theorized, like said on the channel, the storm caused the server outage. Because he That's apparently Enos. was having He's huge lightning Enos, over there. Right there on my name. To which Star then echoed to the forums, which was actually not changing. true. The storm did not cause it, uh, which then led to, of course, the usual uh, trollish type people saying, what kind of two-bit operation are you running? Well, we are a two-bit operation, but we're not that two-bit. Uh, we do actually have uh, the stuff in a data center that has multiple redundant backups and uh, its own generators and all the other jazz. And two different, full different power grids to make sure. And then we have dual power supplies, so if either of the power grids go out... Uh, we should be doing, there's, it shouldn't uh, happen that we actually lose power up there. Two bits. Two bits for you, Mr. Arca <laughs> Hemp Strike. Uh, but anyway, so we're not that uh, we're not that much of a two-bit operation. Is that where you're going? Two bits? <laughs> now I get it. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, yes, uh, at that point, the uh, crowd starts tossing two bits just for giggles and grins there. But uh, it just because it's a two-bit operation is uh, hey, I didn't say it, you didn't say it, he said it himself. But uh, hey, man, now and it... I, again, I know a lot of people got questions, and I know that uh, I've got questions. But I just gotta say, for real first, uh, Serena Melorian, thank you for the follow. Doctor Deus, also thank you for the follow. As uh, Doctor Deus, I know uh, I saw you like something of ours out on Twitch, or not on Twitch, on Twitter. And uh, whenever I see stuff like that, I add you to the day's uh, shout out. So if you're wondering how we found you, that's how it happened. And uh, anyway, so yeah, um, just. Yes, yeah. You know, the the question, I guess that I'm I'm begging to ask or begging for an answer to is, uh, again, we all assume that if you're in a data center, you had all this redundancy backups, and of course we've been poking fun at it with, for the last week or so because we've had no actual updates. And uh, uh, the question, I guess, is. If you still have all that redundancy in the machine powered off, all he had to do was go power it on and power it off. I I don't get what would have caused the hiccup to cause the machine to power off in the first place. I mean, did well, you gather anything I, on that? Because from what I gathered, from I mean, it, it, yeah, correct me if I'm wrong. At this point, he turned it on, turned it off, but all four nodes failed after that. Is that what we heard? Well, blue screen of death kind of thing, and then you you're stuck with rebooting the system, right? And then, but his his assessment of what ECC memory does is kind of wrong. Well, everybody, anybody who knows anything about memory and ECC or non ECC really yeah. knows that while ECC is supposedly better, it really yeah. doesn't do no. a whole hell of a lot. He's absolutely uh, right. Yeah, so, uh, oh wait, uh, so, Enos, the green room is supposed to be the waiting room before you go live on air, but <laughs> Laz and myself are too damn lazy. We're too to lazy it, to move to the live on make air. Make it to room, the right. live on air channel, and so we do the entire show from the green room. Yes. Because we really don't care. So when you uh, come in between 1 and 2 Eastern Time yeah. or 12 and 1 Central Time or whatever time it is, we're live on the air in the green room. That's right. <clears throat> and of course, don't forget, we are the only show on the air that welcomes you, the viewer, to come join us in Discord, in chat, on Twitch, in the game. And come talk about your yes. your viewpoints and anything that we're talking about. Tell us what's going on in your town, with your things, with your events. Because that's what we're here to do. We're here to tell you what's going on in and around town. But yeah. uh, I, I found that interesting. Again, uh, 
You know, nice to know that that's all there, but with double redundant power supplies, the machine's still powered down, and that that's really, you know, again, hardware failures happen. Blue screen, we, blue screen or a kernel panic, it restart now, the machine. Um, um, one of the other things that we did not play here, Chris goes on to explain, because a lot of you guys and gals out, out there ask, well, what about the back door, you know? Is, doesn't everybody have the uh, IT, IPF or whatever it is, uh, you know, on your servers, and of course they have it. Um, it's there, but uh, what Chris said was that leaving those open uh, left vulnerabilities and security for the servers, so they disabled and shut them off, so that there were no security holes for people to sneak <laughs> in through. Um, so uh, it's a damned if you do, damned if you do situation. You either leave it open to a possible vulnerability and live like that, or you turn it off and avoid the vulnerability, but put yourself in this position where um, when something happens, you physically have to go to the co-location. So, yeah, I, yes. I have not done server <clears throat> administration stuff in over fifteen years. I yeah, is I, oh, I've done like, setups, installs, yeah. cabling, but you know, I never. Yeah, I, I admit my stuff. I don't want to be in charge yeah. of anybody and, else's security. And remote <laughs> server administration has changed drastically. Just, yes. just a wee yes, bit yeah. in 15 years. <laughs> just just a, just a wee bit. Just just um, remember when that guy from the IRS calls telling you uh, he wants you to connect to your computer. Yeah, go ahead and uh, let him yeah. because he'll go yeah. ahead and take care of you. Yeah. Yeah, no, he'll don't do take that, care of folks. Me. Don't do that, folks. Anybody calls will, and wants to connect to your sure computer, it's a scam. I will make sure that I'm running a virtual a machine, and it will just be like <laughs> last born. Yeah, well, you know, I tell you what, I I lives. actually get a kick. I watch them during my downtime. I watch the uh, people who, who, who mess with the scammers, and uh, I got a guy who likes to, uh, he calls the scammers back on purpose just to get access to their machines so he can delete their shit and reverse it on them. So I like watching mm -hmm. guys like that who do stuff like that. Uh, always fun to watch the scammers get I've got rude. a much more interesting social life. I like to read books. Yeah, you like to watch porn, we know. That too. Yeah. You're just you're just I reading mean, the insert of the DVD. That's the book something. you're reading. Uh, <laughs> yeah, no arguments there. Eh, eh. I could deny it. <laughs> I put the subtitles on. Jeez, I tell you what. If if, if uh, we just had the recording of the first five minutes of you coming into the room today, I tell you that was just priceless. And I of think what. You, you coming into the green the room today, the what? first five minutes today, were nothing but, yeah, just... <laughs> Why, what was going on? Uh, every other word of, out of your mouth was a word that I probably would be embarrassed saying on, on the year live, let's just put it that way. <laughs> Not that would I wouldn't say a lot of those words. Would, just, I, be uh, would I be embarrassed by... These no, ones. because I don't even uh, think you uh, knew you were saying it half of it because it's just your regular thought process. <laughs> oh, when I was looking for the memes? Yes, when you <laughs> came in and you're looking for the memes, man, you were just rambling all sorts of bullshit. I tell <laughs> yeah, you what. I <laughs> that first oh, yeah. five minutes was just like, my oh, goodness. Yeah. It's, it's like, oh yeah, I need to save that. I need to save that. It's like, yeah. Uh, yeah. That's right, folks. I also got to remind you that our Discord is an NSFW room. Is uh, You don't want the boss seeing some of the stuff that gets posted there. Some of it. Not all of it. No, uh, they're, you they're, want them to see it all. Actu okay. Actually, if, if most you of you have... You want to share it? Yeah, if you, most of you have everybody. work sites like we're used to, then your bosses probably want to see those memes so that you can brighten yeah. their day. So you may want to share them. Who knows? <laughs> Yeah. No, I I like the uh, the other one because I just yeah. You, I, you I, like the the bead pulling competition? The, the, the tug of war, yeah. The tug of yeah, war. Tug I of just war. you know yeah. trying trying to visualize that is just. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't know if there's one song. called that the uh, econ this. Oh, and the voice sound effects bot is not in a voice channel. 
It doesn't have to be in the voice channel. It gets called when you do it. So if you uh, do something like that, it pops in, Yay! plays, and leaves. It's it doesn't have to be active. It's always active. So and it's active for everybody, not just us. So uh, but yes, play yeah. booty. Okay, work. I'll shake your bouncy booty. Hit it. Ah, uh, there it is. And that's just PVP, I believe. Not just, yeah. All you gotta do is, uh, or maybe just P. I forget. Oh, no, I didn't do that yet. I've only got up to G in there. You can do question mark list. See what's there available that I've put. You can do question mark popular. You can do question mark new because every other person who uses this spot, all their sounds are combined in it. So there's a database of thousands of stuff. Yeah. Yes, that's just the stuff uh, so, that I've okay. got. <laughs> Let, let's go back to Chris's server comments real quick. Yes, let's let's jump back to that. Uh, yeah, so <clears throat> he had a machine that he wasn't able, he didn't have a box that he couldn't smoke test it in. And remember, a smoke test on a PC is essentially it boots up. It didn't catch on fire. Everything's okay. good. Um, I thought a, it was just a 24-hour run. No, is usually no, no, what, that's yeah. a burning. That's yeah. a burning. A smoke yeah, okay. test is essentially <laughs> just, eh, it, it booted up. Let's go. Then uh, I'm used to a burn-in when doing new builds. You run it yeah. for 24 hours, you give it a stress test. Hold on. And, uh, but, is that too cool? Booty call? Lunch call. <laughs> He's yeah, telling. Okay, sorry. I got a half I hour, guess, man. Tell him you got a half no, hour. No, 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 no. This, this is this is something else. Uh, this is completely. Explanation. Else. I love free shit. Giving y'all another minute or two to get in before we close out the early giveaway for Palomino or so, set, folks. To me, that sounds like more like Chris just ordered some RAM, decided to upgrade the RAM on the server box, and just drop it in without testing it. Because yeah. he didn't have a box, and that it that story right there has too many misconnections in it. So again, at least we have I don't some know updates, what and it wasn't actually the storm, but it was the storm. The storm. It wasn't storm the storm. Caused the delay. Man. This. It wasn't a storm, but the machine went down. Right at the exact same time as a storm was in Austin. And nobody had a rowboat to navigate the streets and of Austin during the storm is what the problem was. Then, well, it wasn't even a big storm. It, I mean, it was like <laughs> over in five minutes. Oh, uh, then okay. after that, it was, uh, then they took it down for another few hours so he could do a MIM test burn it. Not a 24-hour burn in, but just a four-hour, two, three, four-hour burn in. Okay, looks good. Looks like the memory's not going to freak out on us. <clears throat> and then they brought the boxes back up. This is kind of like, let's patch something straight into the live game. The smoke test is the build compiled. We're good. <laughs> I'm in Florida. Jack's in Austin. Yes, Jack uh, is in Texas. Yeah, yeah. I'm in Florida. How do you right how now. do you right, right. pronounce that? How do I do it? Orvendi, is that right? Orvendi one. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you don't know how old school. Arvendo. Okay. I'm I'm looking for the actual conversation that you're trying to include. In Twitch chat. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the place where everybody chats besides Discord, where you post all that. And, yeah. Naked stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Our vandal. Okay, I'll try and remember that. Hey, man. They're kicking it old school. Yeah, something like that. We're kicking it, all right. No, they're 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 kicking it. They're kid. I mean, it's like they've got two cans and a string. Sometimes the string's a little wet, and so it curls up a little bit. It's all good. It's all good. <laughs> oh, <You don't laughs> I thought he was talking about us. 
<laughs> oh, yeah, well, you got to go out to uh, the NBNN News Channel and uh, look up a uh, $7 million yeah. video is with Dallas when we were down there years ago. Uh, well, yeah, that I mean, was a, that was a joke. Got to got to use the coat hanger to fix the servers. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it, it's re- realistically at their first offices in Austin, uh, they've done they did three office moves before they decided to start working at home. Uh, the first office, they actually had everything on top of folding tables and on, t- was, on top of a banquet it, it table was, it was, it was a, a it banquet was table stacked yeah. on a banquet table with servers on them it was a, yeah but, and, but that was only like the production servers everything. in-house that was only the production yeah. servers in-house that wasn't the actual game server yeah it wasn't just, the game server yeah but just everybody else yep <laughs> uh, see, he's he's got some history. Uh, he's uh, he worked for a game company in Austin, uh, where we he built the game server in the office. Yes, mm-hmm. <laughs> around the corner from the old OSI offices. <laughs> yep. But yeah, so moving right along, what else do we have today? Uh, well, I'm moving right along. Uh, there were the comments be? on specialization. Specialization. Now, I didn't actually uh, hear him on that one. I I, again, I I knew you posted it. I have not watched that one at all, so... I uh, did not post anything on specialization. I, oh, wait. Upgrading of skills. Uh, upgrading of skills, which is, yeah, again, this is, uh, again, uh, people are now posting in the forums uh, when they hear Chris say something. So a lot of the topics that we've been and, covering... And what about these subsidized late, radio stations? Well, we'll get to that in a minute, but... Uh, yeah, what what's been happening without the with the absence of the stand up corner is people who are watching Chris's stream hear something that Chris says and then they start a topic which gets the community started or several people start the same topic which you know gets a little confusing. Oh, yeah. But thankfully, I follow all that stuff and I, I try and make some some sense. Yeah. I have yeah. I'm, testing. I'm with dead. I try and make some sense out of it for you folks, but. Uh, yeah, specialization. Let's just get this uh, up on screen. I know I've got it here someplace. If not, in Discord. Yeah. Oh, that's oh, an interesting uh, picture. Upgrading <laughs> of skills. Uh, let me get back um, here. I, I did read through this post earlier. And yeah, I, was, I, yeah, I, was, I, I was, gotta say, you guys have posted a lot of shit since that. <laughs> I, I will say this is a, about as clear as mud to me, but yeah. Yeah, uh, and again, I'm just going to put it on screen and I'm going to paraphrase what I want to say if I can find the damn thing here. I know it's here. Okay. That's Wednesday, and then... It's tab number 73. Yeah, I don't have it tabbed. Uh, Upgrading of skills, I found it. On my computer, it's tab number 256. Yes. I'm surprised I'm surprised you don't error out with that many tabs. <laughs> 32 gigs of RAM, man. Yeah, I got I got 32. I got 32 on my laptop. Hey, I got 32 on my box. I got I got RAM. But uh, anyway, I got, uh, let's I get got, it up on screen. Uh, upgrading of skills and again he goes to say I was thinking about the newest mount announcement of crafting specialization and the possibility to make specialization more interesting while st- still keeping the you can do everything aspect and I'm just gonna stop right there okay we hit on the topic of uh, specialization and more meaning uh, with the actual combat not, or combat it's not the actual combat system but what's this what's the word I want to use the skill system and uh, yeah that you're limited to two specializations and uh, the example yesterday uh, was using taming uh, just as the point and that the next level of creatures should have specialization attached to them to make it more oh, yeah. specialized now, Absolutely. my understanding from everything I've gathered so far is that when it comes to crafting, um, you're going to be able to specialize in everything. So, you'll have crafting, and again, let's just pop on over and uh, 
you know, they get the skill trees up for everybody here. And let's just bring this up real quick. I actually happen to have the so this, crafting skill So everybody can look up. at the, the lack of... So were you looking at crafting or... Uh, I'm, I was at crafting, but I'm over on adventuring. So you see all the different skills we have here in adventuring. And out of all these skills, you can only specialize in two. And that's it. Two. One, two. Two one, out two. of combat, yeah. magic, and strategy. That's right. Whereas in crafting, we have essentially about the same amount of skills, essentially. But uh, each one, apparently, you're going to be able to specialize. Now, again, I haven't heard this verbatim, but this is my understanding. Happy birthday, Lord British. What? You're a little late on that, that, aren't you? That, that was July 4th, man. Well, let's see. Condus, the... Uh, Five minutes ago, <laughs> in in uh, in game chat. <laughs> but uh, are you sure? Uh, but my question is: if everybody can specialize in everything, then that's not specialization, is it? No, no, it's not. It's, <laughs> I mean, that's or is exactly it just an what... oxymoron? I mean, I it, don't know. It is. It is <clears throat> my problem with everything is that there is no specialization whatsoever in the game, even with the specialization skills, because they're unnecessary. Again, and I, I beg to differ last, on that, but it it is unnecessary. They might you, add a little bit. They add a little bit extra you power. You asked Justin what the difference in her healing is between specialized and not specialized, and I'll tell you what, I'm leaving the room while you get schooled, okay? That's all I'm going to say, okay? Ask anybody hey, who's specialized. The, 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 fact that, the fact that you can actually heal, and you don't need that specialization, the specialization provides a bonus. A um, major it's, bonus. Again, you, hey, you, hey, if you haven't hey. specialized, don't knock it. That's all I'm telling you. You you can knock it all you want, but until you tried it, a yeah. generalist in the game. Everybody yeah. can GM, get 200 skill in every single one of the skills. Oh, you know somebody who's got 200. Do you, do you no. know somebody who's got 200 any skill? No, but I know people that have 234 okay. GMs. Well, that's not 200 and any skills. So, again, I, I don't still, mind I mean, us exaggerating a, a little, but nobody's ever hit 200. Nobody's going to be I'm running around I, with 200 and 200 and 200. I, I, and 200. I, know, a few, I know a few 140s. Yeah. I, I yeah. heard of, I believe, one guy over 150. One guy. Okay. But, again, a guy. 200, yeah, 200 I still don't see anybody ever hitting it. I know somebody who's going for it, but I just don't see it. You, you know what? <clears throat> I, if if they didn't GM every other skill, they possibly could have uh, gotten a skill up to yeah. 200. Is, uh, you tame it all? And, no. Uh, I, okay. I don't tame and I don't summon. Right. I, I don't do any of that. And, and Liz says no one's going to hit 200 in anything anytime soon. That's, which uh, yeah. Means, that's... Which, which means, wait, but List was... Were you around when they told us that in order to hit 100 in any skill, it's going to take an, a year? Up to a, a year. Solid, no, not up to a year. About a solid year of hard work in order to hit 100 in any skill. Three days later, our first GM. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. We know that went out the door a long time ago with buffs and potions uh -huh. and all that stuff. Yeah, but again, yeah. uh, I'm, I'm going to defend the specialization because until you've tried it. And again, I'm holding off because I, I don't see a need for it on my end just yet, one. And two, because it's such a limited choice, when I make that choice, I don't want to waste my time. You know, I, when I do it, I'm going to specialize and I'm going full hog on it. So until that time, uh, same thing goes with dungeons. Dungeons still have <clears throat> a couple things and kinks to work out. And uh, while I've built my first dungeon, which you can visit below behind us there at the inn, um, it's a small dungeon, but it's all connected and it's got some rooms in it. But that's it for the moment. I'm not decorating. I'm not doing anything because, again... Um, like 
everything else changes come eventually and again you got to rip stuff down start over this that the other thing and i'm just trying to avoid that these days so anyway moving right along Yes, so let's right move along right along. I never did, did they close that giveaway. I told them no, I was going to do it, so let's do that. You didn't do, do a, a whole lot. <laughs> I know, I'm just discombobulated here. <laughs> Radian Hoodlander. Congratulations. Give me your in-game name. Is it Radian Ho Hoodlander, I'm going to guess? <laughs> it, it's Hector, the trash collector. The plumber. I've come to fix the Mario. sink. And uh, waiting on that. And while we're waiting on that, let's figure out. Are we going to give away another Palomino? I think I'll just make it easy and give away another Palomino away today. We'll give away okay. horses today. Whatever. Or should we give away I, a I, duck? I'm on, I'm on game number five of marbles. <laughs> and, I haven't uh, even loaded marbles. And, and Taco Tuesday... Uh, Taco number one is about to be completed. Taco Thursday, you mean? Taco, Taco whatever. Thursday. Yeah, we're gonna do that. We're just gonna do give away two Palominos today. Oh, I I don't know what this post is. Laz doesn't know what this post is. He's trying to summarize it, and he's only gotten to the first paragraph so far. That's what that's I'm done. What's going on. So, that, that, that's it. Oh, I'm done. So you only, we're, we're done. You're done? You, we're done the, with that? The upgrading no, of skills was, from what we understand there. or what I've been able to ascertain. Now, this guy goes into a hole, and I'm just going to show this on screen. I mean, he's he's got a whole big treatsy on this, and this is from Lars yeah. von Trek. I, I, was, I was confused by it because, Trek, it, to me, it doesn't now, make a whole lot of sense. Yes, uh, again, if you're the numbers type of person, but when I saw this, again, th these, uh, this actually popped up in the Daily Britannian, which is where I pull a lot of stuff from, so if you want to get a heads up on any day, open up a copy of the NBNN Daily Britannian, check out the headlines, see what's there, because good possibility I'll be talking about some of that on our daily show. But uh, let's get to the next... Uh, I opened that giveaway already. Good exclamation. I love free shit. Uh, let's get to the next one because, again, and I'm going to preface this with a disclaimer. Uh, this is not official. This is what Chris has thoughts in his head and what have you. And uh, let's see. I got to fix this so that... Uh, <laughs> Which means coming to us next tomorrow... <laughs> <laughs> this is the 34 minutes right <laughs> this is uh 34 and change mark yes yeah. is where we're at yeah uh let's go this. ahead and click play in three two one play uh there's some talk on radio stuff but i don't want to talk about it yet because we're gonna i'm about to I meet with some people to actually have a real talk on it, but we're talking about uh, a couple things. One is what we can do to keep Avatar's radio around. I think that rumor is leaked out about uh, quite a bit because I've had a bunch of people ask me about it. Uh, so we're working on that, but we're also working on the other thing we want to make sure people know is uh, if you guys, if somebody else starts a radio station, we will gladly add it to the the uh, interface. That's not something that is exclusively for NBNN or Avatars Radio or something else. NBNN uh, is thing not is a radio I'm start station. A, uh ten percent of my stream that I'm gonna donate to a radio fund uh for anybody who's running a uh the internet radio stuff for us. Which uh again if multiple people are doing it, if multiple people need help, we will help I will just split that fund. Uh so again Try not to do too much, but ten percent is works out to I think I think we did like maybe last month, uh thanks to your amazing generosity. I think the stream uh made about twenty three hundred dollars, so that'd be about two hundred and thirty dollars a month, which is enough to cover at least some radio stuff for people. But anyways, we'll try and nail that down. The other thing we're working on is uh I'd still have to formalize the document for the stream reward stuff 
they're going to be changing up how we do bits with streamers uh, just to try and make sure we keep people on a level playing field uh, and for some people that'll mean that they will get more uh, crowns in game more free crowns and for some people it mean they will get less but we're going to be looking at uh, there's a bunch of different steam charts that show are not steam charts stream charts that show how many viewer eyes people have uh, while streaming our game so we'll be going off of some of those and setting some numbers on those and that's so we want to make sure and uh, you know reward these guys you know, like El Garion and some of these other guys who uh, stream a ton famines and Dulane and some of these other guys who stream a ton and give great content uh, we want to make sure that they get extra crowns for giveaways because if not like if you're streaming 100 hours a month and you get the same amount of time uh, and have you know 40 people on your stream on average and then there's another guy streaming 20 hours a month and has 10 people on the stream and like the crowns if we give you all the same number of crowns then obviously the guy with a smaller audience and short amount of time does more giveaways and that type of stuff we want to make sure it's kind of proportional to uh, that <coughs> stuff so anyways the short version is it'll help probably help the top uh streamers out there and lower it for all right so as I, I don't know what to say about that or even, uh, oh my God, really? Really? You're going to have a streamers program and you're going to give streamers stuff. You give everybody an equal cut across the board. Have you not heard people scream favoritism a million times around here, folks? Uh, you yeah. know, just, just stop it, guys. Stop it, okay? Yeah. Again. The, so, Jack, don't... you're not getting nothing because you don't stream. You got no numbers. You get you get yeah. nothing. You know, the other guys <laughs> exactly. who scream 20 hours a day get everything. I don't know. I'm calling bull on that. That's all. And I'm stopping there. That's all. That's that's crazy. But uh, it's, anyway. It's a lot of bullshit. Yeah. Is uh, yeah, I don't get it. If you got a streamer's well, program, here's the rewards for being a streamer. Period. Not we're gonna reward some people more and some people less. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, no. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm so, sorry. Subsidizing the, radio stations. Really? Are you really gonna do that? I don't know about that either. Uh, that well, just that blows okay, me so. away. So there's more than just Avatars Radio and Wadia Radio Free Britannia and the Haunted House of Menwin. Now well, those there's, those it, are the three major ones, correct? Well, th those are the three that are on the in the Ether Amplifier. Correct. If you want your if you want your radio station included, you can run a shout an Icecast server or a Shoutcast server, and then just plug it, send that IP for it to support at portalarium.com my my biggest complaint here is for the 300 millionth time nbnn is a live stream that broadcasts on wrfb radio nbn is not wrfb okay folks get it straight wrfb is a radio station nbnn is a show that plays on the radio station so please Jack, stop calling the Bible. radio station nbnn it's not nbnn thank you hey jack shut over. Up. <laughs> jack i told you to shut up i told you to shut up jack i tell you what you know i'm last oh wait no <laughs> you're last i'm jack i'm sorry but it's a pet peeve of mine for yeah. five years now people have been calling the radio station nbnn and i'm sorry it's wrong. It's not NBNN. Go look at the Ether Vibration Amplifier. Here we go. Radio Free Britannia. I don't see anywhere where it says NBNN on the Radio Free Britannia. I just don't see it. Does anybody else see it there? Hello? Nope. Okay. This is a show that airs on the radio. Not this is the radio. It's not the same. It's different. Wake up, guys. You're killing me over here. Anyway, <laughs> okay, separate entities, okay, if I stop doing the show, the radio station still still exists, so if the show doesn't air in the radio, it's still a radio station, you know, get it through your heads, anyway. <laughs>
<laughs> I don't know. It's, I don't get it. <laughs> but, yeah. Yes, uh, by the way, I, I, I am... Yeah, I have other information that's going to be coming forth. But again, that's not official because Chris told you that he was going to talk that, to people that, that, that yesterday. That <laughs> they're going... That, that Shroud of the Avatar or Portalarium is buying Avatar's radio? That again, Chris alluded to? Just the rumor. Yeah, uh, he was going to speak to some people. So uh, I don't know who he was going to speak to, but uh, probably go sit down and have a powwow with Star. But again, uh, till we have official announcements, all, all this stuff, all we can do is venture our guests but, uh, and give you our commentary. But uh, Wait, I'm not asking you, List. I don't care. What's that? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Stop asking List these questions. Oh. He doesn't List, know. You, you'll be happy to know I found my paper, by the way. It wasn't in the floor downstairs. It was in the floor upstairs, and I was able to grab it. So. Hey, uh, um, if, <laughs> um, hey, List, I lost a, uh, uh, a founder castle. Castle uh, lot deed. Can you deed? replace it? Tax free, yeah, yeah, tax free, ta tax free founder <laughs> castle deed. Can you replace it? Uh, I don't know where it is, a and I also lost um, 375 hertz of Brit Britannia. Yeah, yeah. Uh, isn't that like all of the ones? I don't even think that many were made, were there? It, it, it is every single one ever made. Yeah, okay, that's what Plus I thought. <laughs> yeah, I'm right on top of that, Rose. <laughs> Yeah. Love the reference list. Love the reference. <laughs> but it is another day where we have, some uh, somebody named that movie in my stream without cheating, I will give you ten scrolls. <laughs> Are you sure you want to play that game? <laughs> Do you know it? No. Okay. Ah. <laughs> uh, I'm right on top of that rose. Uh, da, 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 ding, da, ding, da, ding, da, ding. Da, Ekondis he knows his movie trivia. That's right. Congratulations, uh, don't, Ekondis. Don't tell mom the babysitter's don't tell dead. Mom the babysitter's dead. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that that's got uh, the chick from uh, Married with Children in it. Yes, Christina it's Applegate. Christina yeah. Applegate and her yeah. job. And in her job, it's, it's I'm right on top of that rose. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There you go, Ekondis. I love this shit. Hey, hey I, 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 I don't know. I, I knew the actress in it. That's all that matters, right? I, I, I thought it was a pretty cool you know, thing that the stoner dude took up cooking because it reminded me a lot of myself, you know. As a, I was a you know, stoner growing up, and I tell you what, <laughs> cooking was a great way to satisfy the munchies, man. So, yeah. uh, <laughs> Laz, you forgot to, to qualify your sentence yeah, uh, that's uh, okay. Yeah, you qualified it with growing up. Well, you yeah. you want me to quantify it now by claiming now. that I still am? Is that what you want? Yeah, <laughs> yes, I would like clarification. Okay, there. well, yeah, I think everybody yeah, knows yeah. that already. But hey, Bill and Ted, <laughs> uh, third parts coming out. They're uh, they're in filming and in production on that right now. So. If you all haven't heard, yes, Bill and Ted are going to come back. Uh, Cano is uh, actually uh, reprising Who? that role. Cano? Who? Yeah, I know. I'm, uh, I'm from Brooklyn. Fuck you. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, man. Love you too, baby. <sighs> Killing me, Smalls. <laughs> I know. It's uh, TikTok, TikTok, because uh, we're totally uh, out of whack here today. But that's hey, right, because not, not there, my fault. Is, there is no script here. It's a train wreck every day right here on NBNN. And but, of course, but yes. the train wreck goes back home uh, next week. Yes. Well, uh, you, yeah. Speaking of which, uh, th thankfully, I never booked plane tickets for that trip because I would have. <sighs> I would have been screwed because I was booking for this weekend when the party's actually next weekend. Um, so I would have really been screwed because I... Oh, I, so next week is going to be super, super short? Like three so days? So next week Tuesday, may even Wednesday, be Thursday. super, super short, yes. Because uh, if this I, I all comes that. back together, then 
you're not coming back till Tuesday, so it'll be a Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday next week, and then the week Whatever. after. Again, all up in the air. We'll keep you posted as we get closer because, hey, that's how we roll. You know, this guy just makes you know, random trips to Florida to get tattoo work done, you know. Whenever, whenever he can sneak out you for just, a weekend, you just, you just broke <laughs> up there. Yeah, don't worry about it. They heard it. No one heard it. <laughs> but yes, moving right along. NBN and Shredder, the Avatar app available in the Google Play Store, the Apple iTunes Store, or the Amazon App Store for all your electronic devices. And if you're looking to see what's happening in and around game. Check out the NBNN Shroud of the Avatar community calendar on nbnn.info. It's brought to us each and every day by our good friends at hometownhero.com. And yeah, we got to remember to do that on Wednesdays. Got to remember to talk about Sarah and Andar's show, but you'll do that here in a minute as well. So oh, hold on. Moving I can't right do along. anything right now. I can't do anything <laughs> right now. Okay. Because he's got to leave. I don't know. I guess he's got to go take care of something. So I'll be reading the calendar. Of course, don't forget. You can catch us every Monday through Friday here at noon. 12s and 6s around the clock till 12 noon live. And catch two idiots interpreting the news like nobody else's business right here on NBNN, which is broadcast simulcast on WRFB Radio Free Britannia. Understand simulcast. Is uh, coming up at 7 o'clock today. This is the 70s at 7, where we get our freak on and check out what's a bit less from the past, the 70s at 7. 8 p.m., the nurse is in. Hello, nurse. But can unmedicated. You help, can you help me find the kid that scammed me out of $40 worth of Pokemon cards? <laughs> no. Really? <laughs> yeah, that, yeah. 10 p.m., like, uh, the Wicked Womb with Waz's Wad, my dad. That's right. Waz's Wad on the Wicked Womb? That's right. And at 11 p.m., the Sarah and Andar show part do uh of course yeah it goes to show you how much i know about uh, the folks working on wrfb sarah and andar do a show every late night wednesday every early morning thursday it's 1 a.m to 3 a.m central time but of course they're also doing a show from 11 to midnight as well which i didn't know jack showing off his artwork Yes, he's finally getting caught up there. Well, list one at a preview. <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> but yeah. yes, as a reminder, you're watching Lunch with Laz and Jack right here on NBNN. Simulcast on WRFB. Fix the tear in the uh, ether right there behind you. On your... yeah. Yeah. It... <clears throat> he's got a tear in the we... void. We we can we can fix it by pulling. Got a, it. Got a hole into the real world. We can't have that. I, I can't even <laughs> see what's over there. And if you want to help support us, like uh, Badanum did, uh, Waldo, uh, you can click on links below and uh, help support us there. You can cheer in bits. You can toss some cryptocurrency over on Jack Stream. You can use the links on the website you can come become a patron at patreon.com slash nbnn and of course the britannian mining company always wants you to come check out black rock cove for all your crafting goods our friends at hometown hero follow the links below or on the website for deals over at hometownhero.com purple dragon ends and shroud music for all your uh, housing and musical needs, relicspiral.com for all your licensed Shroud Avatar swag. If you want to save some money, promo code NBNN saves you 10% on checkout. WRFB, Radio Free Britannia, different from NBNN, different. <laughs> Bringing you the latest news and entertainment 24-7 around the clock, inside and outside Shroud the Avatar. And of course, you know... I do my best working horizontal. 
a best yeah, worthwhile yes, horizontal. Do. I, I do. I, I love because, the Shroud Marketplace. Yeah. Congratulations, famines, on that brand new shiny town lot. Thank you for that's right. Supporting weddings and more by me. That's right. Yeah, Shroud, shroudmarketplace.com. Over 100 different, 150 different players registered as vendors. Each one of those vendors is responsible for setting their own prices and maintaining their own inventory. You could be just like Laz who woke up to $100 in his PayPal account because he sold something last night and delivered it. When did you deliver it? This morning? Yeah, this morning. You, yeah, rolled, you know, I didn't, you even get, yeah. didn't even get a notice. Otherwise, I would have gotten up and delivered that last night. Didn't didn't come on my phone. I don't know why. That's your phone's problem. I know. It's a, it probably needs a reboot. I haven't rebooted yeah, it in like weeks. Probably, yeah. Because, uh... But I yes, got a notice. don't forget everything you can ever <laughs> want. If you've got TMS syndrome, you got too much shit floating around, and I you know. want to get rid of some, Vosh says, buy my shit, because Vosh is trying Vosh, to get rid of Vosh, some of his stuff. Vosh has some obsidian potions up, up for sale right now. That's right. So you got services galore. Yeah. If you're looking for services, they're available. And of course, weddings and more by me because it's not just weddings it's no, a whole lot shop. more go to, go to my shop to, to ignore last right. shop but, or go to uh, caffeine shop go to caffeine's or go to skeggy's skeggy go to anybody gotta anywhere. go to skeggy yeah. shop because skeggy needs some beer money for his trip to the convention oh, this year yeah. because we need to have skeggy buying us some uh, beer while he's here We're gonna roll the credits thanks to b dotham for the cheers, Dr. Dreyus and Serena Malorian Thanks for the follows. Can't thank lose. you, thank you, thank yeah. you. And of course, we'll be back with the weekend roundup tomorrow right here on NBNN. Till then, I'm Laz. I'm Jack. And we are NBNN. We'll be back tomorrow with more. And of course, stay tuned for the giveaway for you folks on stream. Bye-bye. Alrighty, folks, and let's go ahead and pull that giveaway. We're going to close this out. We're going to pick the winner. And Twilight Tempest, you have won. Congratulations.